Hello, my name is Dan Harmon, and I am the Automotive Sector Marketing Engineer for Texas Instruments Current and Magnetic Sensing product line. In this video, I will discuss how a magnet rotating off axis can affect the magnetic field measured by a nearby sensor. A magnet being off axis only really matters when it is rotating around a central axis, which is primarily used for angle measurements. Generally speaking, these applications use a diametric disc or cylinder magnet so that the sensor output is sinusoidal, which makes measuring angles more convenient through the use of the arctan2 or arc sine functions. With an ideal angle measurement system, a diametric disc magnet will rotate with its axis rotation at its center. In this ideal system, a nearby linear hall sensor will produce a perfect sinusoidal output. If the magnet rotating is tilted within its axis of rotation, the change in the magnetic field will cause the output produced by the sensor to no longer be a perfect sine wave. The output may change based on the orientation and severity of the tilted magnet. This plot shows one possible outcome where the sine wave gets skewed. When a magnet's axis rotation is not at its center, the magnet will wobble as it spins. This changes the intensity of the magnetic field sensed by the sensor, which in turn affects the sensor's output. This plot represents one possible outcome based on the orientation of the magnet. The more off-center the axis rotation, the more it will affect the sensor output. Also, the orientation of the magnet affects the shape of the sine wave. This example shows an unfavorable magnet orientation to the sensor. The closer a system is to ideal, the more accurate it will be to just use the arctan2 or arcsine methods for angle measurements. If the waveform produced by a sensor is significantly different from a sinusoidal wave, then it is probably best to use a lookup table calibration method. If the signal roughly resembles a sinusoidal wave, then it may be easier to use the arctan2 or arcsine method and just calibrate for error. For more information on calibration techniques for measuring angles, see TI's app note at the link on this page. To find more magnetic position sensing technical resources and search products, visit ti.com slash hall effect.